Memorial Day weekend usually means big business for local bars and restaurants, but the weather on top of COVID-19 concerns affected some spots more than others. Alana Otler in Dallas with the details. These streets may look empty now, but this weekend was an entirely different scene in Deep Ellum, as many bars and restaurants reopened for the first time since the beginning of the pandemic. This is probably the first street that we've actually been able to get through because you can get through Main Street. They're just walking and they can't even get in oh, nowhere. Alexandra Toribio was so shocked by what she saw Saturday night, she asked her relative to start recording. Nobody seemed concerned. Nobody seemed like they were holding back. Um, people were standing in crowds, hanging out. I, it was just regular Ebellum. Last weekend kicked off the governor's second phase of reopening Texas, allowing bars to reopen at 25% capacity and restaurants at 50%. Heavy rains dampened some expectations, pushing spots like the Rustic to pivot. We do have half of our business on the patio because we have such a beautiful patio. So that does create a couple of challenges and try to seat everybody inside. Today, customers arrived as soon as doors opened, some trying to make the best of a rainy holiday. Our initial plans were to actually go out, be outside and bike, but uh, given the circumstance of the weather, I uh, we figured we'd be inside and eat some good food. But Dallas County Judge Clay Jenkins is urging caution, asking residents to opt for takeout or delivery when possible. As we want to keep um, the economic recovery from this going. And the best way that we do that is we don't have a second wave of COVID. While Toribio says she's not ready to venture outside, she understands why others would. I think it's a double-edged sword right now because I understand where the businesses are coming from. I think they're trying to feed their families. The Greater Dallas Restaurant Association says at this time, it's still too early to tell how establishments fared over Memorial Day weekend. In Deep Ellum, Alana Altler, CBS 11 News.